Thank you, Dean Hickson, for the kind introduction. Welcome, first year and transfer students, new staff, faculty, and trustees, and welcome to all those returning to Pomona. I'd like to start by taking a moment to look at this image from the James Webb Space Telescope. Share a copy with your neighbor if you need, or describe it to them, and think about one thing you notice in the picture. The yellow and orange structures remind me of the Jemez Mountains near my home in New Mexico, lit by a starry night sky. In fact, depicted in this image are what we call the cosmic cliffs. They form part of the Carina Nebula and are actually composed of dust and gas, and they are a region of active star formation. Perhaps calling them cliffs something familiar helps us stay grounded in the image because to me, it's a beautiful picture and other than likening it to mountains, I'm sort of at a loss for words to describe it. In addition, the colors in the image are not what we would see if we were to look at the nebula with our bare eyes. Now, that doesn't make the picture fake. The colors really encode information about light emitted at wavelengths we can't see. There are a lot of things we could take away from this image. The universe is vast, stars shine bright, and what we see, what we put into words, is never going to be the full picture. There's no correct interpretation. I can't help but return to Pomona because after three years here, I still struggle to find the words to encapsulate the experience. Beyond that, each one of us is going to have a unique uh, experience and interpret it differently. What I can say with confidence is that college is a time of growth, of revisiting expectations, and of diving deep beyond what meets the eye. I came into college planning to major in physics, which may not surprise you since we're looking at a picture of outer space. But on the first day of classes in my first year at Pomona, I impulsively dropped my physics course and enrolled in corporeal mime. It was not the type of mime you might be imagining. We didn't pretend to be stuck in boxes or pulling ropes. The class was more about harnessing the way our bodies move naturally to make art. And while I may have tried to avoid the intimidation posed by a physics class, corporeal mime threw me into the deep end. It was so far from anything I imagined studying in college it forced me to be vulnerable, to embrace unfamiliar concepts, and I came out of the class feeling empowered to take any course that interested me. Corporeal mime helped me make my way back to physics. That is to say, your path in college may not be linear. You may not end up studying what you expected. The beauty of Pomona College is that we pursue a breadth of study. We take the classes we were planning on, and then some. Throughout our time here, we have the opportunity to build connections between seemingly disparate fields. So to the first years who are still figuring out your schedules, it will all fall into place soon. A class that falls into your lap may have a profound impact on your college experience. To the new students, I want to acknowledge that this may be a nerve wracking time as you start your first week of classes at Pomona and I congratulate you on getting through your first day. I'd like to reiterate the advice I gave to you after you ran through the gates to be patient with yourselves. You have more than this week, this semester, or even this year to figure out how you want to spend your time at Pomona. Remember, each of you is uniquely qualified to be here, and as you forge your own path through college, I and ASPC will be here for you and growing alongside you. As student body president this year, I plan to focus on growth in every sense, from increasing student involvement in institutional processes to advancing sustainability efforts, fostering equity and inclusion in academics, and centering students in ASPC initiatives. I envision Senate to be a true organization of the students. And I maintain that students as a collective have the power to make institutional change. I will work to make ASPC a valuable resource for you 
and I hope that you will engage with Senate throughout your time here. I'd like to come back to the photo for just a moment. This region of space is called a stellar nursery. It is actively forming stars. This picture is a snapshot in a moment of growth. We are looking at stars in the making that are interacting with one another as they evolve and that may eventually move apart. That is how I see all of you. How wonderful it is to share a space with you at this moment in time, to spend a few years growing together, knowing that eventually we may go our separate ways, but that we will always be connected to our stellar nursery of Pomona. Thank you, I wish you all the best for your time at Pomona College.